I'm blocking the whole <laughs> camera thing. <laughs> Sorry, people, I'm not a professional. Uh. Hello, everyone. Lorenzo here from RVT. So today we're gonna be doing a hive inspection on hive number two and three. See how they're doing. Uh, I saw some bees going in and out. So out of hive number two, hive number three doesn't look too, you know, too good as hive number one. I guess it loses a little bit. I just saw a bee going in and out. So we'll see. We'll check it out. See how they're doing, and then we'll go from there. All right, so it's like 80, 85 degrees right now. Uh, I just put some nectar about two days ago. No, no, it might have been three days ago. See, as you can see, the nectar still, still looking good. I just put it in like a couple of days ago, three days ago, something like that. So uh, they still have like three frames in here. So I was thinking of maybe bringing the frame from the healthy hive, hive number one, out here, but we'll see how they're doing today over here. Looks like this frame has, they haven't touched that frame. We'll see about have number uh, number three over there that's the one that was concerning me oh yeah they look they're doing a lot better today see look at that got some brood on there looks like they're expanding their area more uh, see some uh, pollen in what time of them let me see if the queen is on the other side yeah I don't see the queen on this on this frame but they have brood so I know the queen is in there and besides that, you know, they're easy to find on this hive. <laughs> the queens. On these two hives. Looks like I've got freaking broke. All those flying roaches. Where'd she go? Or he, whatever that is. Oh, they flew off. All right, got away from me. Looks like they drew more comb on this side. So this, they're doing pretty good. I was thinking about installing a uh, frame from uh, from my other hive on this. This this queen is always evading me. So I better be careful because I haven't seen her. She's probably on the on the wall over here. I'm not gonna mess with it too much. So they're doing pretty good. Last time I was having trouble with this hive, this queen.
All right, that was a quick inspection on hive number two. They're doing pretty good, so I'm not gonna mess with them too much. Just let them be here. Let them be. All right. Oh, hard to. Now we'll move, move on to uh, hive number three right here. So hive number three. All right, I have to get my smoker even though I haven't used it. But hive number three is the one that I'm concerned about. Oh my goodness! <laughs> looks like uh, looks like I don't know what's going on here. But all the nectar, I mean the nectar, the water sugar solution is gone. And there, we have more ants on this one. I've been meaning to do the uh, concoction thing. Oh no. Got some high beetle issues here. Maybe that's why they've been struggling here. Looks like the uh I see an unknown bug on the earth. Yeah, it looks like they have high beetles on this one. Not a lot, but they're in there. I see one here. Took off flying. Wish I would have gotten it, but I don't know what's going on down there. I think we have some. Hot beetle issues big time. Not big time, but small problem. Because it, it doesn't look that bad. Let's see if, the, if we find the queen on this side. Yep, there's my queen. I can find the queen on the other side, but I see my queen on this side. Yeah, I might have to get my, uh, this, this hive is not looking too good. I mean, it, it, there's just a little, a little brood area. As you can see right there, there's a queen right there. And, uh, little small patch of brew there I, I only see one um, I don't know what's wrong with this queen but she's not she's not producing anything she's not producing anything she's got I see two of them on this side Do my high beetle killer.
Yeah, I'm gonna have to come back and do my ant concoction thing. There's a lot of ants in here. Alright, so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna bring a frame from the other hive. Maybe some resources and put the, the frame in here. And that's gonna be my plan for today. I wasn't planning on doing that, but that's why I'm gonna have to do that so this hive can succeed because the queen is not doing so good. So I'll be right back. All right, so here we are, hive number one. Uh, I had to make sure that since I marked the queen, it's gonna be a lot easier for me. You find the queen, make sure I don't take that queen with me. So I'm doing a operation emergency <laughs> hive. Oh shit. This hive is like way too big anyway. So way too big. I'm gonna grab my smoker. I'm just gonna scoot everything. I'm gonna get into my brood right here. This is my brood area. Scoot everything out that way. Hopefully have less fatalities like that. Windy today, that's not good. So I'm just gonna try to grab some uh, nursing bees. Um, the uh, the other bees that are not nursing bees are gonna just fly off. Mm -hmm. Just have to make sure that I don't grab the queen. This one doesn't look too good. This doesn't have enough root in it. It's a lot of hatch brood though. over here more I'm gonna bring you on this side so you can see better see I got my box ready here so that's one gonna put my uh, the, the uh, frames and then I'm gonna put two um, two empty frames in the in there I 
haven't gotten into the brood area in a while, so. Not good. I don't see the I don't see enough root here. I'm trying to find like uncapped brood so those bees uh, are the ones that are gonna actually take over the hive over there This wind's picking up. Well, I think that the queen just stopped producing. Because I think they had too many bees. So the queen is just not doing anything anymore. I just have fatality there. Got a fatality there, so when they when they sense that uh, when they sense some something bad, you know they start.
Uh, this one looks pretty good. It's got brood. Got resources on the top. I just have to make sure that I don't take the queen with me. So I had to inspect this frame like really good. <laughs> taking this one. I don't see the queen anywhere. I'm replacing that one with the drawn out comb. Is this still recording? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I got stuck on my glove. Got stuck on my glove and the bees went bananas. I need, I'm blocking the whole <laughs> camera thing. <laughs> Sorry people, I'm not a professional. Now I'm gonna pull a frame from out here. Frame with resources, aka honey, and everything else that comes with it. <laughs> if 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 it's on on there, cause like pollen, bee bread, and all that other good stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna take this one. It doesn't have much on it, but. Still working on it. Uh, these are mostly workers, though. I don't know if I want to take workers. Yeah, I'm not gonna take the workers. So the workers, though, they'll, they'll leave that. I've come back over here and that's gonna be pointless so I'm just gonna stick this other frame in here let him work with it this is our other empty frame
There we have it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take this bees over to the other half and not waste any more time because I'm wasting too much time here. All right, we're hive number three. Back to hive number three. This heat is killing me for sure. It was 85 when I started. I'm pretty sure it's like went up five degrees more. And it's supposed to get up to like 97 or something like that today. So I had to make sure my queen safe on the other side, which she was earlier. I know that. So I'm going to go ahead and put this uh, frame in there. I'm going to put the frame in there. Um, and then give them some smoke. Oh, I'm a smoker. Oh, shoot. I didn't know what's open. This doesn't stay closed, that's a problem. That's a big problem right there. I'm puffing a lot of smoke in the hive. So the firm one doesn't smell like I just hope they don't I just hope they don't kill the queen. That was the only concern, but if they do then I just have to deal with that later. This thing just keeps going back. All right, so this is what I did. Put the bees in there, smoked them. Got a bunch of bees left behind there, so hopefully they'll They'll find their way up there to the entrance. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, close the hive. I'm gonna close the hive. Maybe. <laughs> I'm gonna give them a little bit more, more smoke with the hive close. See, so yeah, what I, with the smoke, what I'm trying to do is, uh, I'm trying to confuse them with the Queen Fairmont, and hopefully they accept the Queen. But 
we'll see what they do here. It looks like they're looks like they're flying in there, so we'll see what happens. We gotta leave it there for a minute, see what happens. I'll go ahead and put some smoke in here so I can get him out of here faster. I mean, that was a lot of bees. I didn't realize that. One, that was just one frame. <laughs> Funny. They are so confused, they don't know what to do, but they're, most of them are going in there, so that's good. Hopefully with that, with the smoke, they'll... They don't uh, realize that that's not their queen, and they move in there and settle down and everything, so... Feels like a swarm here. <laughs> yeah. yeah, some of them are gonna go back to their hive. And that's fine. I just need the nursing bees in here. Looks like they, they're going in there, so that's good. Oh man, there's a lot of them going in there. Looks like some of them are finning. Tell them that the queen is in there. Look at that. Hard to tell, but... over there some of them in there in the fanning They look so confused. They're like, is this our hive? Is this not our hive? <laughs> I noticed that some bees are going into that hive over there. Which is fine with me. <laughs> as long as they uh, settle down somewhere. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and wait here for a little bit and then show you guys after all right it's actually the next day i had to do something i had to go get uh, something from the store by the time we got back it was getting dark so i decided to just come back today this morning and uh looks like the i removed the the box right there and it looks like we have bees there going in and out, so. 
hopefully this worked and hopefully they didn't kill that queen <laughs> but only time will tell I'm gonna give them about a week see how they do and uh, if they do pretty well then I guess I'll call it successful but if not then we're gonna have to I don't know bring a frame from the other half with fresh eggs or something or hopefully there were enough uh, lar uh, larvae in there to or eggs there were probably hopefully there were eggs in this frame so they can make another queen but we'll see T only time would tell now now it is it is all up to them um, and hopefully they'll 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 take off from here so but it looks like there's more activity now than there was um, like yesterday <laughs> before I put the frame on there in there so that's gonna be it for this video uh, if you want to see sneak preview for YouTube follow me on Instagram uh, and make sure you just like and subscribe I would really appreciate it if you do that uh, and that's it thank you for watching